disease is one of the number one killers for women in Mississippi. Most are unaware of their condition before going to the doctor. 12 News Marie Minifield explains how an organization is working to bring awareness to this silent killer. Today we light the governor's mansion red to kick off Heart Month and to highlight heart diseases impact on women. Today the governor's mansion glows red in support of American Heart Month. First Lady Elia Reeves and the American Heart Association gathered today at the mansion in support of women fighting against heart disease. As women, you know, we all take care of our families and our spouses and our kids, but sometimes we don't stop to take care of ourselves. With heart disease affecting one in three women, transitioning to a healthier lifestyle of consistent exercise and a balanced diet reduces the risk. And so really this heart month is about reclaiming your rhythm and really trying to get back in a good healthy habits. Only 55% of women realize heart disease is their number one killer. And less than half know what are considered healthy levels of cardiovascular risk factors like blood pressure and cholesterol. There are many factors that contribute to a healthy heart. With the recent stress of the pandemic, mental health is a key component to the risk of developing a form of heart disease. The association's been focused most recently since the pandemic around mental well-being and mental health and the effects that it can have on physical health. The American Heart Association is encouraging everyone to participate in their national Wear Red campaign. So tomorrow we want to encourage businesses, individuals, wear your red. You can post on social media. We have Instagram and Facebook and hashtag GoRedJS. And to show your support. We really want to turn everybody's uh, social media pages red tomorrow. For more information on heart disease, go to WJTV.com in Jackson, Marie Minifield, 12 News.